and welcome. This is Melissa Armour with Stocks Wash, and I wanted to just talk to you a little bit today about options. One of the things that's very important about options is getting the timing right. If you take the trade and get the timing exactly right, when the momentum is going to explode, whether it explodes up or down, that's the best case scenario to get a trade where you can get in and out of it the same day. Today was a day where you could have done that. Early entry in the market short today, which would have been a put as an option, or short as a day trade, and then falling off and holding it into the close, you could have exited today, or you could still be in it if you did an expiration out past today. But again, every time I look at a gap, which is all that I trade, I'm always looking for momentum. My expectation is that whatever I do, I'm gonna get a big move in it. Does that happen in every trade? No, but it does happen in a lot of trades. Today is a good, it's a good example though of when I can see something very early, okay, see the setup, get in early, and then get the move, you know, at a very good price. So for example, I'm gonna show you one of the options trades I called today. I'm gonna show you in the chart. It was over 260% return on investment from the moment that I called it, if you held it into the close. It could also be up way more on Monday morning if it follows through lower Monday. But again, it had a beautiful move today. Someone had asked me about this trade today. And I said, listen, this is so far through the strike. I'm gonna show it to you in a minute. You can't screw this up, <laughs> basically. If you, I said, if you wanna get out of it today before the close, get out of it today before the close. You could get out of half, hold half. If you want to hold it, hold it. Again, options, when you take something and it continues through the strike, whether up or down, depending if you're calling or put, can be extremely, extremely profitable, especially if you have a lot of time left in it too, because time matters. The faster you get the move, the better the move is, the more profitable the move is, the bigger the return on investment. And again, that's the whole point. Some trains are gonna lose. So you've gotta have some big, juicy winners like this was today so that you can make money and cover the trades that don't work. You still have to have more winners than losers. That just goes without saying. And if you're somebody that is losing more than winning, then you sh you're doing something that doesn't work. But also, if you never have any big winners or very few very big winners, you're not doing that great either because you still gotta cover the ones that don't work. You follow what I'm saying? Now here is the trade that I called this morning. I'm not gonna show you everything I called today. I'm, I've had a long day myself. Um, so I called the SPY. So this is what the options letter newsletter looks like if you wanna sign up. The date comes on it at the top and whatever we're doing, the ticker symbol, that's the SPY. I called this at 10.05 in the morning. It was sent out Friday, today is the 26th. Symbol was a SPY, strike was 4.15, expiration date was next Friday, September 2nd. So this still has a week to go. Type is a put, so if it's a put or a call, you'll look there to see it. I also have the numbers for the targets at the bottom here, and then the possible resistance level, levels. Again, this was a put. This helps you to know where to go to look for your exits, each of these points, each of these numbers, okay? So let's take a look at where the market was at 10 a.m. when I called it. Here. So we were trading roughly around 417, and I called the 415 puts. And it was it was a great call because we spiked up. You could have caught it on the spike, like had a better got a better price, and then got the drop. Drop, 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 drop. And again, we ended up closing today below 405-ish. So this is, you know more than ten dollars in the money you like whatever happens on monday this isn't this is like i mean something crazy could happen monday but i highly doubt this is going to be over 4 15 come monday morning so and even if it is you know that's the chance you take when you hold something over the weekend you always take a chance when you hold something over the weekend no matter what because anything can happen on a weekend. There's a lot of news overseas that the things that happen on the weekend. But this was an extremely profitable trade right here. If you took it at the right time, when I sent it out, 
and exited it into the close, you could have made over 260%. That's a good trade. That's a fabulous trade. That's a nice trade. You book the money, go into the weekend, have a nice weekend. So again, this is an example of what? It's an example of momentum. Momentum in the gap that happened today in the market. And so again, when you're looking for trades to do, if you don't have conviction what you're supposed to do, you might have gone long today. Why? We actually rallied. Here, let me just see if I can blow this up. I knew we were lower. It was a great call. Not just the timing of it, but to see it. So again, I sent this at 10.05. Here's where it lifted. You know, you can see that people went long. How do I know? We rallied. So we went from 4.15 straight up to like almost 4.20. And then we collapsed. That was a great call. So anyways, you know, if you're someone that wants to do options and you're looking for great trade ideas, this is a great newsletter, especially for the price of it because it's an active letter and you get a lot of trades over the course of a month and a year. And again, depending on your risk, you get a trade like today. If you risked $1,000, you could have made 2,600 bucks today. And again, if you risk 10,000, you could have made even more. You can risk in something like this in the SPY Again, we only do things with volume, but you could have risked whatever you could have afforded in this to make 260%. You can take a small account and build it up pretty fast with the calls that I'm making because when we get trades like this and moves like this, you can take a $5,000 account and build it up to 10. There will be trades that lose, but getting back to what I was saying, if you have big winners like this, you're making money because the more winners you have and the bigger winners you have, it covers the losers and then you're up. You can take money out of your account. You can grow your account. You can trade bigger size. Your confidence grows, your conviction grows. You're able to hold it. Again, a bunch of people were calling me today and emailing me today. What I thought here, like roughly around the lunchtime period. And I said, you gotta watch it. You gotta watch it. We could sell off all the way into the close. I was right. So, you know, sometimes people just need a little nudge in order to hold something and that extra eye. And I'm very good at reading price action, live price action, predicting it before it happens. I saw that and was watching the market live when it did that this morning and quick got this out. Boom. Perfect timing on this today. But again, those of you that are interested in signing up for the options newsletter, that's what it would look like. It comes to you in live time and it is up to you to decide how much you want to risk and to do the trade. If you have questions about this, you can email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com and congratulations to everybody in the options newsletter today. It was really a fantastic day. Have a great day.